Church, this is the reason why we're doing ransom again. Now listen, hold on, before you cheer, before you cheer, before you cheer, before you cheer. We learned some things last year. We learned our platform was way bigger than I thought. We learned that there were a lot of people who were looking for things to be able. And I was like, oh, shoot. If this was at the PAC or the Performing Arts Center, they would love it. Because it was on the wrong day, at the wrong venue, and it was kind of (laughs) good. Now let's be real, they want me to come out here and whip somebody and like spray some ketchup and it'd be like, Jesus' blood. <laughs> come on, let's be honest and they will clown the church about it. And we're like, they didn't come to Christ because of that? No, it wasn't excellent at all. We saw the Heinz in the guy's <laughs> So cause there was it was like, ah, oh, that's too much. And y'all done rewrote Beyonce's song. And I, I mean, I know the song and that wakes my spirits up. And I just, I get you. So do we stop doing it? Oh, no. Because there was over 600 people got saved. But, what, but watch this, but watch. But we're not prideful to say, yeah, we're just going to do it the same. No, we've been cutting on it. We've been submitting it. We've been looking at it. We done rewrote almost all the songs. We've we've taken the things that we said, could we do this better? And what we're going to do is this year, we're going to perfect it in-house. This is why it's not going to be live on. Okay. So, yeah, it won't be on live this year, so you won't be able to check it out. I know we talked about it. I remember when we had um, the fresh... Fresh leftovers over here, and yeah. then we had a kind of big conversation. What do you guys think? Um, like I, I always say with Mike Todd, I try to take each each incident, yeah, yeah. on its own because <laughs> I know people already don't like them. So yeah. Um, with this, um, the Easter play, I, the 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 message I always send him is that um, I've been in a church that slowly started getting addicted to becoming viral. Yeah, and you start you know, trying to do things to become viral and, and you kind of get away from the point. The play, I saw the play. Um, if you watch the whole thing, it, it is, you know, something you would see at, you know, a church that was really good at production. Right? Yeah. So the thing, the segments that got cut out that were based in hell, um, I can understand if you saw that without the rest of it, it it's kind of shocking, you yeah. know. Um, but I do like the fact that he said that they've been cutting on it. What I hope he means is that we accepted some of the criticism. Yeah. Right. I don't think all of when you hear stuff that when if people say something to you, it's not all attacks. Yeah. Right. Some of it is wisdom. So I would hope that he would at least listen and say, I'm trying to do the right thing. God, people are saying I'm doing it wrong. What if that is true and what's not? What's the bone and what's the meat? Yeah. I hope he submitted to God in that sense to where some of the things that people are saying are red flags, you know, we won't talk about all of them. But some of the things that we're saying are red flags. I hope he has a heart to say, let me not just shut it all out. Let me let me listen and make sure I'm not deceived. Yeah. And if he's willing to do that, then I got no problem with him. Um, we'll take each instance one at a time. But if it keeps happening to where it's like questionable, it's like, mm, maybe you just like this. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But uh, I, I was thinking about this yesterday because um, me and my wife went to our Easter service at our church. And it was a production. It wasn't like no fire or nothing, but it was a production. It was people dancing, having dialogue. It was like a show. Um, It wasn't a show, but it was like a production of the gospel Mm -hmm. of Jesus and how Judas portrayed Jesus. And we're like Judas, but we got a chance to repent and all stuff like that. But then I was thinking to myself, I was like, how many other churches are going to be like this? You know, with a budget that got, Mm -hmm. you know, different things of that nature. Doesn't mean that you're bad for using the arts. And I think sometimes if somebody can cut a part out of whatever you're part of, you know, I mean, we think about things, destinations, yeah. you know what I mean, back in the day. If somebody took somebody piece and like, see, that's why you shouldn't be doing Christian oh, yeah. spoken you, word, you know what I mean? You actually can. Go yeah. back and watch yeah. our old stuff. You probably <laughs> find a lot of good yeah. clips. So, but what I'm saying is if you take stuff out of content, that's the problem. And I think once I, like, I remember what, it was trying to, he started pulling stuff down from it, so it was kind of hard to find the actual one. So when I finally found one and I l- looked at the whole thing and I was like, I can see why people get <laughs> mad about the whole fire thing, but the atmosphere was supposed to be quote unquote hell. I didn't, I didn't know what Beyonce's on. They flipped, so I, yeah, I didn't yeah. know. I think but, it was what the girl's saying. Oh, got you. So I was just trying to, I was just like, I get what he was trying to do. I just think, um, 
I just think you, I think he has to have wisdom to the point where he knows, he has to know that he's one of those pastors that anything he does, people are going to shoot at him. Yeah. So he has to have wisdom enough to go, um, okay, we need to create one, create our own songs for this production. That would, that would be helpful, yeah. Um, and then also, e- even like like really make it clear what this is. Yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? And I think I think people but but then some people may still have a problem with it, you know yeah, what I mean? But yeah. I, I don't know. So I what, think anytime you do anything ministry related, some people are going to have a problem with it. I kind of seen two things. I seen some humility like Sean was saying like, you know, maybe we can do these things a little bit better. Maybe we don't want to offend anybody. People are going to be offended, but we don't want to just blatantly just say, you know, we ignoring your criticism, we ignoring right. your feelings and do this right here. But I also saw a little bit of sarcasm there, yep. like, yep. we don't want everybody to be mad, That's so let us trim this about. and trim that. And then, two, if 600 people came to Christ like you said, why hide the video? If, <laughs> yeah. yeah. If you, if you, if, if if you stand people, on it, stand on it, yeah. If, you, if 600 people came to Christ and legitimately came to Christ, you feel... I would not give a flip about what nobody had to say. We're going to play this same video because 600 people came to Christ. That would be the fruit. That would be the evidence if it was legitimate. But I understand the humility and stuff, but there was some sarcasm in there a little bit. It was. And was that a purse he was wearing? Hey, uh, that's what I was trying to say. <laughs> no, he was. That was a backpack. <laughs> okay. I didn't know. You know, it's, it's 2024. You got to ask the question. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, I... So I got I got mixed feelings from it. I, I'm not somebody like you said. I don't want to just target a man and make it seem like I hate him or whatnot. I want to see everybody get in. I want to see everybody yeah. do well. Everybody get in. If you're reaching souls for Christ, God bless them. Um, but it's just a few things. I just it's just um, a little red flags. Yeah, just, yeah. I would just if I just advice to him. I'm not against you, bro. I'm not saying anything negative. I'm just saying everything. Everybody ain't wrong. And I would <laughs> I would just just listen to it. That, yeah. The reason I think. The problem with the, I don't know if a church is just a young church, but yeah. the problem with young churches is they're very uh, zealous for Christ and they'd like, oh, let's try this, let's try that. But there's a reason why I think a healthy church has elders and young people in yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, if it's yeah, all yeah, elders, yeah. nothing gets done. If it's all young people, there's no bounds to your creativity, yeah. right? You need you need the wisdom of the older people to say, I remember that. You think it's good, but it's not quite what you think it is. Yeah. That's mm-hmm. going to lead to destruction. Nice. So don't ignore all the wisdom. That's all I got. Hey, what's going on? I hope you liked that video. Make sure you like and subscribe. And make sure you support us on Patreon, patreon.com forward slash Trackstars Universe. In the meantime, continue to watch our channel by clicking on this next video right now, right now.